Hello everyone. Hi. Um, it's me, Bella again. I'm talk to Bella to come. Um, today I'll be talking about a very sensitive issue. Wonder when was Nigerians here there? So you've done it. But I'm not here to judge. I'm just here to ask your opinion. If you are in support for the legalization of abortions in Nigeria, yeah, you heard me, abortion. I know it's a not so polite moral word, but morality doesn't always feel right, even when it is named moral. The thing about us Nigerians is we're hypocritical a lot. Yeah, most of us. Sometimes they can be judgmental, it can be judgeable. Issues are sensitive as this. We have to, you know, put ourselves in some people's position to know how they really feel. I know some people say abortion is murder. Why other people say that? It's not a life yet, it has not formed. But when does abortion become murder? See, um, when I was a kid, I witnessed a very horrible, 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 horrible thing. There was this lady in my compound, just standing in the public compound when I was growing up. There was this lady there, and even though I didn't understand what was happening then, just so I later grew up and then I knew she had an abortion. She went to a chemist, um, a quack chemist, and then she decided to do it there. Then she came back home and she was bleeding massively. She almost died. And when I grew up, that was when I knew she had gone for an abortion. See, the thing about, uh, um, they say, an African program says, when you beat a child with the right hand, you draw the child closer with the left hand. Now, abortion in Nigeria is illegal. It carries a sentence for 14 years, I think. What about circumstances where abortion is the right thing to do? Sometimes it can be for financial reasons, sometimes it could be for medical reasons, some that things they call ectopic pregnancies. So if I'm right or wrong, it's your place to correct me. But things like this, the, the doctor says we have to evacuate the pregnancy, we have to, you know, those are abortions, but just by doctor's prescriptions. There are cases of rape. I mean, I know a child is a child, but sometimes it fucks people up, you know. Just think about an instance where a, a, a lady was gang raped and resorted into a pregnancy and she just wants to have an abortion. You know, it's already traumatizing that something as awful as that has to happen to someone and then <clears throat> you go to a hospital and say, this is what happened. I am not psychologically prepared to carry this pregnancy to death. And then they say abortion is illegal. If you do it, you know, you're going to jail. It is not in my place to choose for people. No, it is, but, but it is in my place to lend a voice out there. Say, uh, um, 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 I say, uh, okay, Christians, you say um, abortion is mother. Uh, um, all children are gifts from the Lord, but if you look at some children, you'd be like, why were you not just aborted from, from childhood? <laughs> That's a joke, don't mind it, but really the government needs to do something about this. I am tired of reading about young girls giving birth and killing their babies when they're just a day old, or people taking uh, um, fake drugs to induce abortion, or people doing all sorts of things because Already the stigmatization is there. You're pregnant. Ah, the baba no collect. I'm a be woo. So you don't do so. Ah, so you said don't they collect. Stigmatization is already there. And <laughs> it's so sad that, you know, man, I don't know how else to put it, but I think everybody has a right to choose this freedom from, right? So, but let it just be legal. I do not support the abuse of abortions, no, you know, I do not support it, I do not, I do not endorse senseless abortions, no, I don't, but you see cases where it is, even if you listen to such story, it is advisable that somebody should do something about it and abortion might be the only way, I am in support of it, okay, sometimes it happens, let's stop being so judgy, I don't endorse the abuse of it, but when it is, you know, what should be done, it should be done. 
government should provide good hospitals so our young ladies will stop dying from going to quack chemists from going to herbalist from going to uh, take stupid drugs or soft in you no know, and you see in hostels in nigeria university hostels you wake up a morning and you see a baby uh, a, a, a baby that's not even farmed properly on the ground <clears throat> I know many people would say, what do I know? What am I saying? Okay. I know many people would be like, God forbid abortion is murder. But, you know, if you've not been there, don't judge. Okay. If you've not that, I, I don't know, somebody, somebody, a friend, um, princess, she owns a blog. She said, Isabella, the abortion rate is so much in this country. And she just said, the rate of Konakona abortion is so much. Cause I know there are self-awareness on um, preventive drugs, there's um, condoms and there's other things, yeah, other things you can think of. Mistakes bound about to happen, a condom might bust, uh, a, a, a pre preventive drug might not work and somebody's not ready to be a mother or a father. I understand. But once in your life should be enough. That's why it should be legalized and your name should be in the system. So in case you turn out to be a serial abortionist, you're going to jail. But for people that really, 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 really need it, people that don't have the finance, that have a, a enough kids, people that were gang raped for health reasons, you know, you know, the government should just make it illegal than trying to, you know, put put a stamp on it like if you if you do it, you're going to jail. You're scaring your citizens. Don't go to all these other places that are not recognized, get infections get injured you know you know stuff like that anyway i just want your opinion if abortion should be legalized in nigeria i'm up for it for good reason i'm up for it but you know i really really like your opinion tonight and you know whatever you can do my name is still better from talk to better.com yeah it's still me i'm on instagram facebook pam chat and twitter like my videos, share, visit my blog. For everything I've said, I've also written them down on my blog for you to read. Thank you so much. I know I have not been constant due to personal readings, but I'm definitely going to try my best. You know, to say things other people are not comfortable saying, you know, just to make your night happy. Thanks and have a nice day.